we meet again on match and entertainment with a friend. So, perimeter and area is a little bit confusing, but it can be learned easily by practicing again and again. So that's our today's topic. If you are new here, my name is Athal. I am studying in VPP world. And also like and share the video and also subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get more exciting and entertaining max videos. So let's go straight to the video. Perimeter is a continuous line forming a boundary of closed geometry and area means the quantity that expresses a two-dimensional figure shape. So this is my computer screen. Now we are going to learn perimeter and area. So first we are going to learn perimeter. Now in perimeter there are three formulas. So the first one is perimeter of, of a polygon means sum of length of all sides. And the second perimeter of a square equal to 4 into side means the square's one side measurement into 4. And the third is a perimeter of a rectangle which is 2 length plus 2 breadth or 2 L plus 2 B. So, now first we are going to uh, see an example of perimeter of a polygon. Now, the peri perimeter of a polygon equals to sum of length of all sides. So, now given alongside is the diagram of a playground. It shows the length of each side. Find the perimeter. So this is the diagram. This is the diagram. Now, in this diagram, there is this is 10 meter, this is 10 meter, so this is 10 meter, Ten meter. and when we have to do the sum of all sides, so this is 10 meter, this is 15 meter, this is 5 meter and this is 15 meter, so if we want the length of this side, we have to do this 15 plus this 15. We have to minus this 5 because it is extended. So, we have to minus this 5 and then add 15 and 15 means 30, cent uh, 30 meters. And this is equal to 30 meters. And here, you see, this is 10 meters. 10 meters it is. So, if you want to make out this length, we have to add 10 plus 5 meters. So it will become this, oh, 10 plus 5 is 15, then this is 15. So this is 10 meters plus 15 meters plus 5 meters this is 10 this is 10 plus 15 meters plus this down this is 10 plus 5 because this extended so it will become 15 and this one is 13 because 15 plus 15 this 5 is not counted because it is extended meters equal to equals to 10 plus 5 15 plus 15 30 30 plus 15 45 45 plus 45 plus 15 60 60 plus 30 90 so it will become 90 meters the answer the perimeter is 90 meters so now let's move on to the second one, which is perimeter of a square.
so for a perimeter of a square then we shall solve one so if the side of a square is 12 meters then what's its perimeter so the formula is for formula is for equal to 4 multiplied by side so equal to 4 multiplied by the side is 12 then 12 meters and then 4 12s are 48 so 48 meters the answer is 48 meters Now let's go on to the third formula. The third formula perimeter of a rectangle 2 length plus 2 breadth or 2L plus 2B. So 2L means 2 times the N. So 2 multiplied by the length. So So let's take the example. If the length of the rectangle is 36 meters and breadth twelve meters then what is its perimeter so first the formula 2 L plus 2 B equal to then the so 2 multiplied by 36 plus 2 multiplied by 12 so the answer is equal to So, 36 multiplied by 2, 36 multiplied by 2, 72. So, the answer is 72, 72 plus 12 twos are 24, so 24 
then the answer becomes 72 plus 24. So answer is 96 meters. So now let's move. So now let's move on to area. In area, in area, we are going to learn two formulas. The first one is area of a square equals to for so sorry side into side or side square the second one is area of a rectangle equals to length into breadth or L into B. Now first we are going to learn this formula. First, we are going to learn this formula. So, a perimeter of a square. So, we will take if the side is 12 centimeter, then what is its area? Then first write the formula side square equal to 12 square equal to 144 centimeters. So it's very simple 144 centimeters. The answer is now we are going to learn this formula now If the length of the rectangle is 15 centimeter and its breadth is 5 centimeter then what's its area so first write the formula 2 L multiplied by sorry L multiplied by B so in here L means 15 into Five breadth is five, so equal to seventy five centimeter. So that's so that's it.